yeah, fixing my son's breakfast because I woke up really late this morning. And happy Monday, you guys. Say happy Monday. Happy Monday. Oh, free hugs. Uh, free air kisses. We love you guys. So I'm just kind of putting some jelly on Ashton's breakfast. So we did get up late this morning. And I really didn't have time to cook anything. So I just went to Jack in the Box. We love their, um, he has an egg, um, little breakfast sandwich thing here, and a half a hash brown. I have the, um, oh wow, what did I just bump? Judy back there tearing up some stuff, ain't she? Okay, Judy, girl, you better stop, okay? <laughs> but, um, yeah, I stopped at Jack in the Box. I went to Kroger's. And I have a haul for you right now. But I stuck by Jack in the Box. I got hash brown that I just shared with Ashton. And then I got my favorite, favorite, favorite. Um, it's called a brunch sandwich. Please don't fall out the box. <laughs> and it looks something like this. And I told them no bacon. But it's just chicken, egg, cheese. And some type of sauce, but I don't like the sauce nor the bacon. I'm really kind of disappointed right now because I really didn't look. I was in a rush trying to get to Kroger's to use my coupons before um, tomorrow because they expire. And so I recently signed up for government assistance, which is uh, food stamps. And I just want to kind of show you guys my food stamp journey and what I am buying. Um, this meal here is going to last me for three days. And you guys probably be like, how does that one? That's a one meal. No, how I prepare it. And I'm going to sh um, share with you guys um, what I'm going to be uh, doing with them for the last three days. So I spent only um, $29 and I purchased some little styrofoam plates. Um, two as well, which they um, food stamps don't allow you to get like pay, anything paper plate wise or anything that's not you know food food I guess. So um, this is all that I bought um, from Kroger's. I'm gonna turn this camera if I can do it. Can I do it? Uh, <laughs> I only um, I'm not embarrassed. I'm not ashamed to say how much I get and how much I have left. Um, so I just want to. Um, you guys to go on this journey with me with um, you know budgeting my food stamps and trying to make a meal <laughs> out of $51 <laughs> and all I have is 22 left because I went to Kroger's and bought a couple of things so I went to Kroger's and bought this 2% milk this is the Kroger's brand Ashton is um, he cannot have regular milk um, because he's a lactose intolerant but what I do with this is that I just um, it has it's a mixture in it's a mixture of um reduce well it's a mixture of skim milk and a mixture of two percent milk and what I do is try to dilute it a little bit with a little bit of water girl these kids don't know <laughs> he don't know like he he think he knows but he don't know that I add water to it or whatever so um I did also get some ground turkey Kroger's brand I know you hear me boo boo. Kroger's brand because it's more cheaper than the regular brand and I love Kroger's brand turkey meat and then I got some cilantro because I just can't be without my cilantro I love cilantro and then I just got some like lettuce um, because this was on sale it was like a dollar and some change my whole total today that I spent at Kroger's was only $29.10 $29 cents. so I did get the Kroger's brand purified drinking water um, I normally get the bottle size drinking water but that was a uh, two dollars or three dollars so I went ahead and got this one because it was only 99 cents um, and then I used coupons and I used the uh, rewards my rewards um, app from Kroger's as well to save an additional 10 percent and then I used the coupons um, that my mom gave me because she gets coupons from Kroger's once a month for being a uh, true Kroger shopper um, and then I got the Kroger's brand low fat yogurt tubes you get four vanilla strawberry four strawberry banana and this is for me and my son um, just in case we want a snack um, and then I got some tomatoes I got some Kroger's 
uh, canola oil. Uh, this is Kroger's brand as well. The grapes were 88 cents, but these were $1.49 because I didn't weigh them out. And I need to learn how to start weighing stuff out. Um, and then I got some organic um, bananas. And I normally get on like three or four bananas, but they've gotten so bold. They put these little things around them so that you cannot like separate them when you get them. And I don't, like really I only need just three or four of those. Because I don't want them to go bad. Um, and then I got some sweet golden corn, which is Kroger's brand. I've learned that uh, canned vegetables are better, way better than frozen vegetables. Um, and basically, it's not even way better than frozen vegetables, but they're the same thing. All you do is wash them really good, um, put them in your Ziploc storage bags, which you can get at Dollar Tree for a dollar, and put them in the freezer. And they're basically the same vegetable that's in the freezer. So those was way cheaper than the freezer brand. And plus, your girl only got $51 for food stamps, so I have to make do what, what I have. Then I got the Hamburger Helper 3 Cheese. I got two of those because I'm going to make two different meals out of these. The first meal is just going to be, this is going to be meals for three days. So um, the first meal is just going to be this Hamburger Helper. Uh, I'm going to use just this box and then I'm going to use, um, I'm going to have this with some of this corn. I'm not going to even have the whole thing of corn. Um, and then just some grapes um, because that's going to fill us up. Me and my son don't really eat a lot, like a lot, lot. And then the next day, we're going to have this hamburger helper, but without the cheese, the um, packaged cheese, I'm just going to make a veggie, uh, a veg kind of like a vegetarian um, vegetable pasta bake with the noodles. Um, and I, I'm still going to have like extra meat from this because I'm not going to use the whole pack of meat, uh, ground turkey for this. So what I'm going to do, um, like I said, the second day, I'll just have like a vegetarian pasta bake with, um, he can have like banana or, um, with a small salad with this one and my son's probably gonna have a banana he's probably gonna have a banana regardless because he loves bananas um and then that'll fill him up and then the third day we'll have our little uh nachos so i'm gonna get some uh shredded cheese which i'm gonna put on here for the bake um on top for the bake if you guys are interested in seeing me make my vegetarian pasta bake let me know um in the comments below and i'll definitely get that video out um, but we're going to have the tortilla chips with the ground, the rest of the ground turkey. We're going to have like a little nacho night. And I'm going to get some avocado and uh, um, the shredded mozzarella cheese, 2% mozzarella cheese. And then we're going to, I'm probably going to put it in the, uh, in the oven to melt the cheese and stuff. And then put guacamole on top. Oh, it's so good. And I love these chips because they have a hint of lime. And like I said, Kroger brand it's a good brand. I love it. I stay true to it. Like, <laughs> it saves me a lot of money, even before my food stamps. Um, and then I got the Kroger cereal bar, um, fruit, grain, fruit and grain bars, uh, blueberry. Never tried these, but never tried the blueberry ones, but I've tried the mixed berry ones, and they are so freaking good, girl. They are so good, sis. So, if you in Kroger's and you run past these, don't doubt these, um, because they are, like, Kroger brand. Girl, they taste so good. Like to me, they taste better than like the other, um, the other. Um, they taste better than the other Nutri Grain bars. Um, so yeah, that's why I get those. Um, and then I found a little treat for Mama, the original superfood Ala Walla, um, uh, juice smoothie, and this was only a dollar forty nine. So I got two of these. Um, and just in case I miss my breakfast or something like that, and. Um, I got some canola oil. I basically had just three coupons for the canola oil, which was free. Um, the tomatoes and the ground turkey. And then I bought these myself. Um, the 30 foam, fo uh, foam trays, which were only just $1. So that's, that's not bad for these. $1 for 30 foam trays. Um, and I'm going to start getting them from Kroger's because that's more than a Dollar Tree, um, offers. Um, I think they only do like 15 trays. I love these trays for those nights where I am just not feeling like cleaning the dishes. <laughs> because I got dishes in the sink. I need to unload that. Um, and I do got a dishwasher. But I just sometimes I just don't feel like I'm, yeah, when I'm having like a, a long day at work, I just don't feel like cleaning the dishes. So I'm sure I'm not the only mom that do that. But this is all plus the other stuff that I got for from Kroger's. 
So, um, and I did get some stuff from Jack in the Box. Um, I got me a mocha drink, and then AJJ's over there. He got him a egg and cheese, and then I got me a chicken. Uh, it's called a brunch sandwich. I got a brunch sandwich with no cheese. It's supposed to be no bacon, but they put the bacon on there. And that's it, you guys. So, thank you guys for watching my vlog. Give us a thumbs up. Definitely subscribe to our channel if you are new. I hope that you guys um, check out some of my other vlogs and stuff like that. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, I have to go to the next vlog. Bye.